Several thousand people have demonstrated in Berlin for a better education system. Teachers, students and parents initiatives had organized the protest march, supported by the unions and opposition parties. We have shabby school buildings, we lack qualified teachers, there are not enough places at university. There are so many problems and we don't have a say. Next week there will be elections, so we want to tell the parties our demands. More teachers, more educators in nurseries, better and cleaner rooms, as well as improved labor conditions were among the many demands of the protesters. According to the organizers, up to 10,000 people joined the demonstration. The job has to be more attractive in Kita and at school too. The situation here in Berlin is very, very special because we have the poorest children here in town. And so we need a better support, a little, more little groups and classes. Classes of more than 30 children are common in Berlin. According to several studies, Berlin has Germany's worst education system. Our schools are not good enough. Uh, well, actually they are falling apart. We are sitting in rooms that are, uh, well, not inhabitable. So that's why we are demonstrating. I want to have a school where my son can go with his asthma without being, um, well, without having no sport, no PE lessons for half a year. We want to have music in all our classes and in all our schools, from the primary to the secondary. I am a teacher myself and also on the staff council, so I know about the teachers' problems, especially many of the older teachers are very ill. Official figures show 1,100 teachers are permanently ill, costing the city-state up to 65 million euros a year, leading to the cancellation of many classes. At the start of the new school year, 200 teacher positions were still vacant. It's important to proclaim that school rooms are in no good condition, that we have too few teachers and would need at least an additional 400, and schools are not offering enough after-school activities. Next Sunday, Berliners will elect a new Senate. Jürgen Zöllner, Berlin's education senator, has already promised 1,100 additional teachers and an additional 169 million euros for the renovation of school buildings. Teachers, students and parents alike are angry with Berlin's education policy. One week ahead of state elections, they want to make sure that politicians stick to their promises and make tackling Berlin's education problems a priority. Stefan Herrmann, Press TV, Berlin.